Deontay Wilder, who is best known as the superstar American heavyweight boxer, has managed to snag himself some pretty luxurious real estate in Lake Tuscaloosa, Alabama, and most recently in Glendora, California. Born and raised in the southern state of Alabama, Wilder always has his training camps there. And with an incredible house like the one he owned, who can blame him? We're talking 5,600 square feet with lakefront property. His most recent purchase was a Mediterranean style residence that features 6,344 square feet and boasts five bedrooms and six Six bathrooms. We are talking about a kitchen built for a heavyweight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a house tour you do not want to miss. In these videos, we don't reveal any real addresses, and even though that we've done house tours of our own, please do not show up at any private residences because it is not safe for anybody. Deontay Wilder has had quite the lucrative career, killing it in professional boxing, garnering a net worth of $46 million, and has earned $70 million in his fighting career. Not too shabby considering that two years ago, his net worth was $25 million, but he has almost almost doubled. In addition, Wilder earned another $500,000 of endorsements, so 2020 turned out to be the most lucrative year of his career. Deontay's most notable paydays include $2 million from the first Luis Ortiz fight, $10 million from the first Tyson Fury fight, $10 million for Dominic Brazil, $20 million for the Luis Ortiz rematch, and $28 million for the Tyson Fury rematch. In addition to a nice little $28 million payday, the Wilder and Fury rematch included a 50-50 cut of pay-per-view profits, so while he did lose the match? Did he really lose financially? Including February 2020's Fury rematch. Deontay's career earnings topped over $70 million. So to put things in perspective, between June 2019 and June 2020, Deontay earned $45 million alone. Both Wilder and the sport of boxing have capitalized on setting up pay-per-view events with guaranteed matches to build up hype and revenue. It just shows how much Wilder and boxing in general have blown up over the past few years. So when you're bringing in the kind of cash that Wilder has been bringing in the past few years, it only makes sense that his real estate portfolio would be pretty dope. While his Alabama home, where he is from, is a stunner itself. He recently upgraded to a California dig that features over 6,000 square feet for nearly $20 million, and it's only a matter of time before Wilder snags another few digs. What's going on guys, it's Clyde Smith, and today we're bringing you another house tour right here on Famous Entertainment. Now, I noticed that about 95% of you watching aren't subscribed, so please be sure to hit that subscribe button because we post new videos daily. If you like these videos, ring that bell for notifications notifications, follow me on Instagram to chat, and as usual, let me know whose house tour is next in those comments down below. Now let's get into this video. For Deontay Wilder, home is where the heart is. Born in Tuscaloosa, Alabama, Wilder snagged a stunning $1 million mansion in Alabama that backs into the picturesque views of Lake Tuscaloosa. Being born and raised in the southern state, he has always had his camps there, claiming, I love doing my camp here. I started out here, and as far as boxing is concerned, and my career is concerned, and we're going to live that out until the end of my career. I mean, who could blame him? The gorgeous home was built in 2012, with 5,600 square feet, and the property boasts four bedrooms and four bathrooms, plus a two-car garage. Although we did the research, and sadly enough, that will not be enough to hold Wilder's mega car collection. But hey, at least he has a huge driveway that he can park them on. The lavish abode features an open plan and is decked out with elegant hardwood floors, a profusion of oversized windows, and an abundance of custom fixtures and fittings. For guests feeling too lazy to take the stairs, they can access a lift that takes you down to the basement. The home features dining, family, and living spaces. And even though Wilder's glamorous home office is where he's been known to negotiate a fight or two. The master suite features a wealth of oversized windows, allowing for loads of natural light, a private balcony, and a walk-in closet, big enough to pose as a room in the house. The master bedroom features dual sinks, a large soaking tub that boasts terrific waterfront views, and a large standing shower, perfect for relaxation. Probably one of the sickest spots in the house is Wilder's kitchen that features stainless appliances, marble countertops, and a marble island that can sit up to six people. In addition, the home features a butler's pantry with more room than you know what to do with. Probably one of the most interesting features of this home is Wilder's panic room, installed in case of intruders. The vault door is made to the same high specifications as Fort Knox's safe, named after the famous gold reserve fortress in Kentucky. I mean, when you've knocked out 41 out of 44 opponents, I would not think of robbing Wilder, but hey, he is a family man. Now, as glamorous as the interior of the home is, the exterior is absolutely gorgeous. And I mean, the home's biggest selling point, though, is the location. Sitting above Lake Tuscaloosa, the 
property features a spacious deck that offers a variety of outdoor furnishings and lakefront views, and comes complete with an outdoor kitchen, perfect for a barbecue. With ample amounts of rolling lawns and manicured grounds, the property features a personal tram that leads the guests through to Lake Tuscaloosa. Lucky for Wilder, the views are unparalleled, with trees surrounding the abode, ensuring his complete privacy. Wilder had recently expanded his real estate portfolio in September of 2020, alongside his longtime fiance and Atlanta television personality, Telly Swift. The two decided on a spacious home, located in the quiet, family-friendly San Gabriel Valley City of Glendora, about an hour northeast of mid-city Los Angeles. Built in 2016, the Mediterranean-style residence features 6,344 square feet and boasts five bedrooms and six bathrooms. For $1.8 million, the exterior of the residence features a yellowish-brownish stucco and accented with white trim, while terracotta tiles top the roof. The front of the property also features a long driveway that leads up to the two attached garages, for Wilder's multiple luxury whips, of course. The interior of the home features an open plan, recessed lighting, white baseboard trim, and a mix of hard hardwood flooring and carpeting that can be found throughout. Guests are immediately greeted by a formal living room, which features a traditional style fireplace framed by an all white mantle and small granite fireside. The home features several double hung windows that allow in an ample amount of natural light. The showstopper of Wilder's new dig is quite possibly his kitchen. The kitchen is exceedingly roomy and features an oversized island and extended breakfast bar area. In addition, there is a lot of cabinet space to stash dishes and kitchen appliances and plenty of counter room to prepare meals. Other Lux high-end features of the kitchen include built-in stainless steel appliances, including a double oven and a fancy six-burner gas range and quartz counters with a butler's pantry. For more formal occasions, meals can be enjoyed in the house's separate spacious dining room, which is decked out with custom fixtures and fittings and visually anchored by a fireplace. Unlike the one found in the living room, also located on the bottom floor is a lavish suite perfect for guests visiting and extended stays. The second floor features its own den and holds the home's four guest bedrooms and master suite. All of them with wall-to-wall -wall carpeting, the master bedroom boasts dual walk-in closets, the size of a boxing ring, and a spa-style master bath, with a luxurious soaking tub located in a window-surrounded nook. In addition, the master bath features a separate walk-in shower, his and hers sinks, and vanity area, and multi-light wall sconces. In the backyard, the half-acre lot has ample space for various additions, like a patio, swimming pool, al fresco dining area, grassy lawn, and heck, maybe even a sport Sports court while there it is family can settle in. All right, so I think I'll bring this house tour to an end right here. I mean, we got to take a quick look at Deontay Wilder's homes and that new dig he picked up in Glendora. After seeing that fancy little abode he snagged, what did you think? Was it everything you would expect out of Wilder? Personally, I'm a huge fan of that home in Alabama, but uh, we'll see how Wilder spruces up his new digs. Out of Wilder's features, which were your fave? You guys can even go ahead and rate them in the comment section down below. My name is Clyde Smith, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.